What's up guys, welcome to Apex. Thanks for tuning in. In today's video, we are going to take a look at some cool customization options that we have for the folders on Samsung Galaxy Phones One UI 7. Now by default, when we open the folder, this is how it looks. We have got a three x four grid size here and we have got this plus button here by tapping on which we can add the applications into the folder. And we also have this color customization option. By selecting a specific color, you can change the background of that folder. Now let me just select a yellow color here, tap on done. And this is how the background of this specific folder would look like. And if you want to change the folder name, you can just tap on this name here and you will be able to change the folder name. That's pretty simple. Now these are some basic customization options that we get by default on One UI 7. But if you need some advanced customization features, then you need to have good log and you need to have home up application on good log. On the older home app application, all these features that I'm going to show you may not work. This has to be the latest home app, app on GoodLog. Before we go ahead, if you are interested in watching these kind of contents, be sure to subscribe to the channel. I keep you guys posted about all that is happening with your phone, all the updates, new features, tips and tricks, etc. So become a part of Apex community to know your phone better. And do not forget to hit that like button if you find this video informative. And yeah, we do have our own wallpaper application. You can check out some cool wallpapers here on this app. The link for this in, is in the description. Go ahead, check it out. Every day I will be adding some new wallpapers almost every day. I would say and if you can add a rating with five star on Play Store that would encourage me to keep coming up with some brand new wallpapers for you guys so do go ahead and rate it on Play Store. Now let's dive in what we're going to now do is to customize this folder we are going to open good lock application and we will open home up already home up is open here let me open this again now I will enable home up here we've got some incredible customization features which are now added on one UI 7 we have share manager edge panel customization gesture settings task changer backup and restore option and we have got home screen option this is where we are going to further customize the folder let me tap on this now again here we have got uh, various different customization options we have got this incredible do-it-yourself home screen as well which we have already discussed in the past and then if you scroll down here you can see we have got the folder options now this is where we can further customize your folder and make it more convenient to use now what I'm going to do is I will open folder screen grid now you can see this is the default screen grid 3 by 4 now what I'll do is I will change it to maybe 4 by 5 let me apply it. Let me open the folder. This is how it looks. Now there is a lot of space available here. If you want to add more icons here, you can just tap on plus and add more icons. And if you want to keep it small, then what you can do is you can just uh, reduce this grid size to maybe three by three. Let's see how it looks now. Yeah, this is how it looks. And you have to scroll towards the right to go to the next application that is available within the folder. Instead, you can increase the folder grid size to three by four or four by four or four by five apply it and this is how it looks now if you want to make this look better what you can do is you can go back here we have got pop-up folder i will enable this now you can see when i open the folder it pops up at the center of the screen and the background wallpaper and all the other icons are clearly visible there is no blur effect here that is pretty cool and that empty space that we had that is also gone now all those icons are fitting within this square which looks very nice so that's quite polished now let's increase the folder grid and see what happens here let's increase it to six by six you see this is very nice now it is not showing any wastage of space here it is well aligned and well within this rectangle right here and it looks quite different as well now let me increase it to seven uh, by seven here we go the icons are small and we have got just two rows here within which all the icons are visible now let's go back to home up here we have got folder icon grid now using this folder icon grid we can customize the way this folder looks you see we have got three by three grid within this uh, folder folder icon in fact uh, that can be changed now let me increase this to maybe five by five and apply it now you can see we have got a five by five grid here which is not looking that great so what we'll do is we will increase or we will decrease it to maybe four by four. Let's see how it looks. Okay. Now, if you've got more applications within the folder, then this would look better. You will be able to see all the app uh, icons right here 
within one single icon that gives you a glimpse of how many applications are there in that folder and you will know whether the app you're looking for is available within that folder or not. So that is uh, one more customization you can do using this option. Now we've got one more option we can apply folder background color. The background of a folder will have the same color as the folder icon. When I enable this and apply a color to the folder, let's say I will apply green. Now the green color has been applied to the icon background and when you open the icon or when you open the folder, you will have the same color background for the folder as well. This is not looking that good. Let's change it to maybe blue or maybe yellow. Okay, now this is how it looks. We've got this yellow background for the folder icon and when you open the folder, you've got the same yellow background here as well. So that can also be enabled using this specific feature. And all these customization features can be applied on the folders on the app tray as well. It will get applied here as well. As you can see, I have got the color in the background for this folder icon when I, when I open it. We have got the same color background for this folder on the app tray as well. So all these effects will take place on the app tray also. These are some cool customization features that we have got for the folders on One UI 7 using Home Up module, which is just incredible. Let me know whether you have tried this on your One UI 7 on the S25 series, or, or if you're on One UI 7 beta on the S24 series or S23 series, you would have already tried this. Let me know what is your experience. Uh, how did you set up your folder? Drop a comment and let me know. That's about it. That's all I want to share with you guys in this video. Hope you have already downloaded Volvo's application. Uh, the link is in the description and uh, hope you have already subscribed to the channel and also give this video a like if you find this video informative. Thanks for watching. You guys take care and stay safe. I'll see you in the next one soon. Cheers. Bye-bye.